Hi, my name's Patricia, I'm an artist, and I'm going to show you how to draw a chow chow. Now, a chow chow is a type of dog that has a lot of fur. You can hardly see this guy's face with all the fur he has. Here's his ear. Again, the fur is covering the ear so they don't come out too far from the head. They're like this. We'll bring it down here. You can just do, you know, when you're drawing the face, you can do the edges just as fur. All right, and then we have the nose here. Let's see. Upside down triangle makes it easy. And then you have his mouth, his lower mouth. And then you can even do a nice semicircle above here for his nozzle. All right, and then we have the eyes. Normally I would do more almond-shaped eyes, but chows have so much fur that you can't see the whole eye. All right, this guy is a happy dog. Here's his ears. And, you know, you can just do lots of hair. All right, lots of fur. And then we have the body. Again, remember, this guy has lots of fur. So if he has fur on the head, he's going to have fur on the body. His tail comes around like this and is very furry. Usually they, they face forward, they can move around, but if you see a picture of a chow chow, you'll usually see it like this. And then it brings us to the back of him. Again, nice big paw, nice big leg, big body. Because this guy is furry. And I'm just going to do fur everywhere on this guy. He is like a big, furry teddy bear. All right. You know, you can, this guy, I made his legs a little bit short. We can make them a little bit longer. Notice how I'm just adding a little length on there. And again, in the back, I'm just going to add a little bit more length, just so that his legs match up with his body a little bit more. Yes, I think this is more, it works better. And then again, just add hair to this guy, add fur. And you have your chow chow. Let's give him a little grass to walk on or ground to walk on. And there you go, there's your chow chow, enjoy. Mm -hmm.